Hi, right, quick video uh, of me opening this parcel which arrived from Hong Kong today and it is a case specific for the Phantom 3, DJI Phantom 3. Not open this, this will be the um, um, first time I've seen it. So this, so I might be pleased, I might not. The person I've dealt with, I've got it off eBay. Um, the person I've dealt with, it was very useful, good comms, highly recommend them for that. Um, I don't know how much like the actual DJI version it will be. I have no idea. It's still quite a lot of money. It's made from ABS plastic, uh, so it's a, it's a hard shell, hard but lightweight. So it, it doesn't weigh as much as um, the ones uh, that are the, the sort of um, the solid plastic. Um, God, who makes them? I can't remember what they're called, but the ones that, which are totally watertight, bomb proof, dry bone, and that kind of thing. They weigh a ton, they're about five kilograms of bag. Hard shells, uh, the, the, the real solid bags are about five kilos. I think this is about one kilo, or is it half a kilo? Can't remember the stats, I'll put the stats up. But it's, um, it is a rucksack and made from um, ABS plastic. You know those uh, type of cases you get when you're traveling. The wheels. This one doesn't have wheels. It's not one of those cases. So all the set. Right, so this is all live. Chuck that down there. So right, it has Phantom written on it, which is quite nice. First impressions before it comes out of the bag, as I'm pleased with it. It's very good. Oh, it's very, very nice looking. Oh yes, 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 yes. Very pleased with that. So it has uh, especially for Phantom written on it. And let's open it. Has it got a lockable zip? Uh, no, it doesn't have a lockable zip. I suppose you could put, no, actually you could put a padlock through there. But then anyone, any good, can get straight in a zip in no time at all, or a Stanley knife, or even a Bic Biro. Uh, you can get into any suitcase without being, uh, without breaking it, and then you can zip it up again if you do that, and the person whose bag you just broke into won't know anything about it. So, um, ABS plastic that side, padded on this side. Uh, it's got a, a chest clamp as well, which is quite nice. And then sort of a bit of an air vent thing going on to help you there. It won't be the most comfortable, but it's not bad. Okay, so I've unzipped it. It's got a carry handle there as well. And here we go. Wow, that looks good. Um, so solid foam. Uh, like almost like sort of compressed polystyrene type foam, not not the uh, not the soft um, squidgy foam you you uh, can get. But actually, I like that. It's lightweight. Um, what we'll do in a moment, I'll get my Phantom over here and we'll put it in and see how well it fits. Oh. <laughs> right. Okay. Are oh, you recording? Right. Okay. Um, so let's get this bad boy in here. So let's just put the uh, Phantom in itself. See if there's any obvious direction it goes in. There isn't. So, um, gently slide it in. Okay, so that's good. Right, so the bottom of the legs, the bottom of the legs are sitting on the bottom of the packaging, so that is as far as it goes. So we get the remote. For sake of argument, let's just take that cable off. <laughs> so that must go in that way. Do you heard a little tip today? You should never have your batteries uh, lying around fully charged. That if you're not using them, half charge is best. Don't know if that's true, but it's what someone told me. That is a perfect fit. Can you see that there? Right, I use a Nexus, Nexus 2 as the tablet. This works perfectly, nice colour match as well. Uh, where do you reckon you'll be for that? Um, let's try down there. So yeah, that goes in there. All right, we have the charger. And I'm guessing that goes in that one. Can that unplug? Yes. That doesn't unplug there. So that fits in there nicely. Okay. Shove it in gently. Like that. Uh, uh, uh. Very elegant, Dad. Thank you, son. Thank you. Right, batteries go 
in there. Only got the one battery. There seems to be a world shortage of Phantom 3 batteries. I've got one on back order. Uh, doesn't seem to be um, enough around. So um, that fits a tree. Look, spot on fit. Now, we've got this little strap. I don't know if that's a good idea because that moulds, if you look over here, Yui, see that's got a mould on the opposite side. Would it be better off not strapped? I don't know. For the sake of argument, we will do it on this occasion. To strap or not to strap? See, I don't like that. See, with that strap across the aerials, I do not like that. So maybe do it from that angled like that. Now, you've got to forgive me. I've only had this a week or two. So if I'm doing something, look at me a second, Yui. If I'm doing it wrong, don't send me any messages, call me a dickhead, like other people have. Just send a polite message, all right? So I'm new to having a Phantom, so be nice. Okay, thanks very much. So let's just close it up, gently. See what's happening there. Uh, yeah, okay, okay, it's all sort of snug, but okay. Zip it up. There we go, one case, carry handle there, stick it over your shoulder, oh, big shoulder, it's not fitting. Hey, and off I go, I'm out walking on the cliffs, wherever, I'm on the move with my Phantom. Um, pause it a minute, just a little foam thing, last thing to say with my uh, with, uh, clip on the, um, the, the rucksack, is I made this for myself to go and boot the car, got little receptacles to put the batteries, little odds and sods, the controller, tablet oh look it's got it written there but it's upside down um so that's useful in the boots big enough to leave the uh, propellers on uh, without things bashing into it so that's great so this is i'll put a link on uh, where i bought this from but so i got it off ebay and very pleased with that it's got these nice little hard nuts nobules i don't know what you want to call it for, for it to rest on should be quite a nice foundation for it to take off if you don't want it in the dirt, you can set it there, off it goes. Um, highly recommend it, I would say. Thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe to my channel, please do so. There will be lots more Phantom 3 stuff. I'm a beginner, so we will suit beginners to watch. Okay, thanks for watching.